February 5th through 9th is National School Counseling Week. And the theme for this year is School Counseling Standards-Based Student Focused. In this video, I'm gonna share eight ideas that you can use to promote school counseling and show the awesome things that you're doing on your campus to support students, staff, and families. If you're new to this channel, my name is John and I'm a school counselor that helps you plan out your events, programs, and interventions. On this channel, we focus on all things school counseling. One thing new that I wanna do this year is play more games. One idea that I have is playing two truths and a lie. We probably play this game during icebreakers with our staff and we probably roll our eyes, but you can tweak this and make it work for you as a school counselor. Create some examples of what we do as school counselors and put one lie in there so you can dispel some myths. Well, here's one that you can use. A, school counselors teach you study skills. B, school counselors do your homework for you or C, school counselors help you with test anxiety. Make these statements funny and engaging, but the goal is to teach them what we do with school counselors. So be creative and have fun with it. You can share these during morning announcements, you can put them in your classroom counseling lessons, or even make a short video and post it on your school social media accounts. You're guaranteed to get plenty of laughs with this idea. Another thing you can do is promote Ask Us three domains of academics, social, emotional, and college and career. Each day you can give them tips, resources, or create mini lessons on these topics. Use this time of the year to your advantage. You can talk about goal setting or organizational skills for academics. For social emotional, remember that the following week is Valentine's week and it's also random acts of kindness. You can share lessons on kindness, compassion, and empathy. After watching this video, check out my random acts of kindness video where I share ideas, activities, and events that you can do for random acts of kindness week. The link will be in the description below. And for college and career, this is the time of the year that we as middle school counselors focus on transitions. So from fifth to sixth grade, from eighth to ninth grade, and even as a high school counselor, you can focus on from 12th grade to graduation. I created a bulletin board where I specifically talk about colleges, careers, and military. After watching this video, check out my video on bulletin board ideas. There's a specific one that focuses on college and career, and I think that you would like it because it's easy to implement. One new idea that I want to do this year is set up a booth at lunch in the cafeteria where students can come to me and I can share tips and resources on different topics, specifically theme days. For example, the theme for Monday will be Mindful Monday and I can pass out coping skills examples. Tuesday will be study skills day. I can share tips on how to be successful in academics. Wednesday is Wellness Wednesday and I can share many different examples of physical wellness or mental wellness and self-care tips. Thoughtful Thursday is kind of a wild card day and you can be creative with this, but I plan on sharing things about gratitude. And Friday is Fun Friday and I plan on sharing jokes, memes, and gifs. You can share a Padlet with the whole school. Teachers and students can input different gifs, memes, or funny things on there and it's just a Fun Friday activity. And if you want something specifically that you can share with teachers and staff, over the years, I found this template that I've been using and, and adapting where it splits up those days and I share a little mini resources and lessons with them. Our students, staff, and the community needs to know what we do with school counselors. And one way to do that is to share your data. Check out my example. I created this on Canva. I shared the title of the classroom counseling lessons that I did for the year. I showed the number of individual sessions that I completed. And then I talked about the small group and other things that, you know, school counseling related stuff. If you'd like to know how to make one of these on Canva, I can create a very simple, short tutorial. And if you'd like to see it, comment Canva below. You can also use this opportunity to send out a simple mid-year evaluation. This is where you send this out to your staff and ask them for feedback on the lessons that you created or the things that you've done at your school. This is a perfect time to get their input and their insight because you may be able to revamp and revise your program. Remember, the theme for National School Counseling Week is standard-based and student-focused. So in order to grow and promote your program, you need to get feedback. You, another thing you can do is participate in Ask Us Photo Challenge. Every day, Ask Us has a different theme. You can download and share Ask Us Photo Challenge by going to schoolcounselor.org. Monday, February 5th, I use standards to develop a school counseling program that... Tuesday, February 6th, I use Ask Us student standards to develop interventions that... Wednesday, February 7th, the Ask Us standards I depend on the most are... Thursday, February 8th, I am student focused because, and Friday, February 9th, I advocate for the school counseling profession by, 
Before you complete these photo challenges, it's best to go on ASCA's website and review the student standards. Specifically focus on ASCA's mindset and behavior standards and how they apply to student success. By reviewing these standards, this will help you complete these photo challenges. And you can print these off, post them around your campus, or even share them on social media by taking a picture of yourself holding your sign. You can create a short video for TikTok, Instagram Reels, or YouTube Shorts describing what you do as a school counselor. Make these videos funny and engaging. For example, one that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna recreate a meme that I saw where it talks about what everyone else thinks about what we do as school counselors. You know that meme, you've probably seen it on Google. Also a couple of school counseling TikTok trends that I wanna create, specifically one that says, I'm a school counselor, of course I, and then you fill in the blank. These are short videos that you can share in your school social media site or even use them in your classroom counseling lesson. Another great way to promote what we do as school counselors is through morning announcements. ASCA has some sample morning announcements that you can go and download on their site, schoolcounselor.org. You can either use them as they are or you can revise them. Every morning on the announcements, either you as the school counselor can get on the intercom or if you don't like the sound of your voice on the school -wide PA system, you can have some students share these morning announcements. If you would like to play games with your students to promote yourself as a school counselor, play Blue Kit or Kahoot. You can create some simple questions regarding what we do as school counselors and our role and how we support, and you can share that with your students during classroom counseling lessons. You can even have your staff play these games and compete against each other during faculty meetings. This is a fun and engaging way to show what we do as school counselors. Comment below, what was your favorite activity mentioned in this video? And if you got value from watching this, please like this video. It shows YouTube that my channel is valuable and so they can push it out to other people. You can also buy me a coffee at the link below. Drinking coffee helps my creative juices flow so I can create videos for you. And if you want more ideas on school-wide events, check out these two videos. One is a video with activities, ideas, and free things that you can do to promote Random Acts of Kindness Week. And in the other video, I'll talk about bulletin boards that not only you can use to promote your school counseling program, but you can also share college and career readiness information in this way. Check out my video to see how. And see you next time.